Hi, this is Ann Reed with Ann Osborne Reed Creations, and I have another um, junk journal to share with you. This um, paper collection I thought was really neat. It's all craft paper, and I think I'm calling this one Craft Paper in Paris, <laughs> with all the dress forms and the, the it looks like, I don't know, shampoo, hat ads and stuff like that. Um, so it has a stitched, the signatures are stitched in, and the back is plain. There's button closures and I put a little clothespin on the end of the end of the twine to kind of give it some weight. There's um, a paper flower and these are wood uh, cutouts. We'll open it up and that's left plain to uh, let you do what you want to on it whether you want photos or journaling spots. And we'll open this up, and here's a little bag with a tag in it, and hand done envelope. The space is, you know, for you to tuck stuff in. Rose paper, I think this is from Smashbook. A little doily with a stamp. More stamping. Graph paper. I really like graph paper to write on. Let's see, in case you want to do a little doodle or something or um, make a sketch of a book or whatever, it's, it's real nice to have those lines. More smash book paper. A doily. Love that rose. Doily, another little paper bag pocket with a tag. Other part of the doily. Some more stamping. There's an envelope with lots of different tags in it. Um, I made these little folders little file folders using the memory memory keepers envelope punch I just thought that was such a neat idea and stamped it on the inside with some lines there's a tag from a tag collection I forget which one though and another foldable folding tag and a tea dyed index card this is a gusseted pocket so you can get lots of stuff in there. In fact, that's why there's so much tucked in here because I didn't want the stuff to fall out. And that's the first signature. And then the second signature, open up, it's a paper bag um, pocket with a tag and another envelope. Some um, ledger paper from a, another paper collection. Doily, right, stamped in there. Graph paper, really, with roses stamped. And I love this um, crossword puzzle paper. It's so neat looking. And there are different weights of paper in here. It's like this is cardstock, and um, this is writing paper. And the stamp here, this the cardstock is is um, tea stained and have another gusseted pocket here with um, different tags in it. This is actually a, a book page um, that I had started something else on and decided I only needed a little piece of it, so I used the rest of it um, for a tag. Some more paper from the paper collection and a tag. to the second signature and then the third signature. It's 
some stamp ledger paper and another little craft paper bag pocket with a tag and then some more tags here another file folder and a tag and an index card these are also pages um, of a book of a previous book that I had altered <clears throat> Ledger paper. So there's lots of space in here to do your own thing. There's a border punch on that page. And then a nice big um, envelope, like a coin envelope pocket for you to tuck stuff in. And then the back is left plain for you to do your own thing. And there again is the back. Back around to the front and close it up, and there it is. There's the craft paper junk journal. I hope you enjoyed uh, looking at it with me, and I hope you have a blessed week. And we'll see you next time.